Now let's do question number seven. The method is same. Just try to understand the language. What should be added to thirty nine point five eight seven to give eighty point three seven five? What should be added? So I I thought ki let us add x. So thirty nine point five eight seven plus x will give us eighty point three seven five. Therefore, x will be what? Eighty point three seven five. This will go that side. So it will turn to minus thirty nine point five eight seven. Now subtract thirty nine point five eight seven from eighty point three seven five. So write it down in a proper way such that the decimal should come below the decimal. Now fifteen minus seven eight. You know now how come fifteen? From here six. Now from here sixteen. So two is left. Sixteen minus eight, eight. Now again, from here we will take, and he will take from here. So seven will be left. Ten and ten will give it to this twelve. So nine will left. So now twelve minus five, seven and decimal. Now nine minus nine zero and seven minus three, four. So forty point seven eight eight. Now question number eight says, what should be subtracted from hundred to give this? What should be subtracted? So again, I thought let us subtract x. You can subtract y also, z also, any unknown variable. So hundred minus x is equal to nineteen point two nine. भाई हम we are saying that we will subtract x from hundred and we'll get nineteen point two nine. So again, x I have sent that side, so it became positive, and nineteen point two nine I brought this side, so it became negative. So hundred minus This and can you see there is no decimal over here, so we'll keep ourselves and zero at the remaining places. Okay, because when there is no where, so we'll put at the end. So hundred point zero zero minus nineteen point two nine. Now again here, how to subtract this? Now from here it will take so zero will left so ten and ten will give to this again ten so nine here and this will give it to here so nine is here and ten is here and this ten will give it to this ten. So ten minus nine, one, and nine minus two, seven. Nine minus nine, zero, and nine minus one, eight. And decimal will come below the decimal. So eighty point seven one. Now next question. Question number nine. What is the excess of five eighty four point two nine over this? Means how much this is more than this? Okay. So again here you are with the word you read excess. You, Understand that you have to subtract. So five eighty four point two nine minus two one three point nine five. Now nine minus five four. Again twelve minus nine three. Three minus three zero. I hope you are getting because this has given one carry to this. So three is left. So three minus three zero. Eight minus one seven and five minus two three. And decimal below the decimal. So three. Beta. This is decimal below here. Okay. It should be very proper, children. Sorry, I made this mistake, but it should be very, very proper. Okay, three seventy point three four. Answer. Now, question number ten. Not ten. Sorry, three. The cost of one kg of sugar increases from twenty eight point four seven to thirty two point six five. It has increased. Earlier, it was twenty eight point four seven. Now, it is thirty two point six five. So, find the increase in cost. How much it has increased? So again, कितना बढ़ गया? Okay, so again subtract thirty two point six five minus twenty eight point four seven. Again fifteen minus seven eight five minus four one. You know now how? Because one this is given to this. So twelve minus eight four and two minus two zero. So rupees four point one eight has increased. I hope you got these questions. Please copy it down.